Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brittany. This is my channel, The Little Light Worker. And I'm really just making this video today to just touch bases on like why I've been quiet on here and um, just kind of let you guys know where I, I'm at in my life. So um, if you have been following me on Instagram or my socials, then you probably would know that recently my um, beloved puggy bear Capone, he passed, he was 14 years old. By the time of me filming this, this happened six weeks ago and it was chaotic, really traumatic, and it was an experience that completely flipped me inside and out. Um, I didn't expect him to go, and it all happened so quickly, and as upset and horrified I was, and still am on many levels, um, because it happened so fast and I did the best that I could, the partner did the best that we could in that moment, it would just, it doesn't make any sense other than it was his time to go. Um, that's the only way I can wrap my head around all of it. But when that happened, it completely shook me to my core, it shook my faith, my belief systems completely. Um, and I went into this really dark cocoon and I felt like I died over and over and over again, like throughout the day, day after day. He was such an instrumental, huge part of my life um, from the moment that he came into my life when I was 18 and I just turned 33 and he's been with me my entire adulthood and so much of my identity went into being his mom. I identified as being like, you know, his human mom and I always made jokes that like I could remember the day I gave birth to him and like, you know, it's just, we were thick as thieves. Like he was, he was my guy and um, I always called him my puppy soulmate. Like. I know that this wasn't our first rodeo together. This wasn't our first life together. And of course, you know, anyone, of course, that has such a deep connection with their companion, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And I know that, you know, our, our relationship, our connection went beyond this life and beyond me being a human and him, him being a dog. Um, he just was everything to me. And... It, like before he came into my life, I didn't even know what pugs were. <laughs> and then once he came into my life and it was like literally love at first sight. Like when I met him, it was, we knew he was the one. And, um, and he went through all this, all the millions of journeys that I've gone through in the past 14 years. He was there for all of it, the good, the bad, all of it. And so when he transcended, I knew that he left exactly at the time for me to completely focus on myself. I, a few weeks before that, I had no idea why spirit guided me to just go into my work the next day and leave a career and forge like head on into faith in the unknown. And my body was breaking down and spirit was like, your time is up. And so I didn't get it, but I went and I did it anyways. Um, I left the career the next day and I spent four amazing, the best four weeks I've ever had in my life, honestly. Um, and then, and then his journey was, and then his journey was, was up and, um, and I've just, been recalibrating and I've been trying to figure out who I am outside of like taking care of him and so making this video is just a, a way for me to be transparent with you guys and um, 
I know like I look like I'm doing pretty great right now and I'm finally starting to feel better. I'm finally starting to come to terms with everything. But I've got to be honest, I've prior to like about a week ago, I've been in a very, very dark place. I've been in the nothingness and I've just really allowed myself to fully be in the grief, in the pain, in the anguish and and figuring out who am I now in my life and so here I am and um, everything that I do um, is really to honor to honor the love that I will always have for him and the love he showed for me and I I know that, you know, on this journey, a lot of times we don't understand why things happen. We don't understand why most things happen. But as painful as this experience was for me, I do also know that it's a part of my journey and a part of my growth. So I'm documenting this experience for myself, for my journey that you can see on my channel of all the different stages and evolutions I've been through since I've started this channel forever ago and um, yeah and just to be transparent like if I seem like I'm different or something's changed about me it has um, that the person the exact person who I was prior to um, him leaving this earth you know went along with him when he did and I'm, I'm not the same person. At my core I am, but um, in a lot of ways I'm not the same person because that experience really shook me to my core. Um, so, <sighs> I feel like there's no like real way for me to conclude this video um, other than just saying thank you for taking the time to listen and Thank you to everyone that's been giving me, you know, their condolences and checking up on me and everything. I really do appreciate it so much. This has been the most painful thing I've ever experienced, to be honest. Um, I knew this day was never going to be easy, um, but I definitely didn't expect it to happen in, in the way that it did. Um, but through everything, I have faith that everything happens divine timing and divine order and that's where i will continue to let myself guide myself is through faith so thank you for watching this video and um for just coming along with me on this journey and i will see you guys next time